Hello there, young learners. Welcome to Reading Redness Centers, your gateway to the magical world of English. Today, we have an exciting lesson in store for you on two important topics. Introduction to conjunctions. And, or, but, and punctuation with question marks. So, let's dive right in. Conjunctions are like magic words that connect two or more ideas or words in a sentence. Let's meet our conjunctive friends, and, or, and but. When we use and, it means we are adding more of something. For example, I like apples and bananas. It means I like both apples and bananas. Now, or is used when we have choices. For instance, do you want an ice cream or a cookie? You get to pick one. Lastly, we have but. It's magical because it shows a contrast. For example, I wanted to play outside, but it started raining. It means I wanted to play, but the rain stopped me. Next up, we have a special punctuation mark, the question mark. It helps us know when someone is asking a question. Imagine your friend asking, are you ready to learn? That little hook at the end, the question mark tells us it's a question. Remember, when you see a question mark, get ready to answer. Let's practice what we've learned. Here are some sentences for you to read aloud and understand. I like pizza and pasta. Do you want a burger or pizza? I wanted to go to the park, but it's getting dark. Are you going to the zoo? Great job, little language learners. You've learned it about conjunctions. And, or, and but. And how the question mark helps us identify questions. If you had fun and learned something new today, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to our Reading Redness Center's channel for more exciting English lessons. Thank you for joining us today. Keep reading, keep learning, and we'll see you in the next adventure. Bye-bye.